Assalamualaikum Emilia. Waalaikumsalam Sarah. Yes. Okay. Uh, next week we will having quiz for subject survival model in chapter seven. Okay. So, uh, I think uh, we need your help. Do you have free time tomorrow to help my friend and I? Yeah, sure. See you tomorrow. Okay, thank you. you need to set in your mind that chapter 7 is not that difficult. It is as easy as an ABC. Okay? Okay. 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 Let's get started. Okay. First of all, do you know that what is the difference between full data and partial data? No. no. Full data is when number of that is used. Meanwhile, full data is when precise age of that is used. Okay, let's get started. The first one we need to know is single decrement environment, which is special case A and partial data. Okay, we have to recall that what is special case A? That is RI equal to 0 and SI equal to 1. L to X and X DX equal to an X factorial over the X factorial and X minus the X factorial multiplied by to x to the power of dx and dx to the power of nx minus dx. Since this is multiplicative constant, so it can be ignored. Next, let's proceed with maximum likelihood procedure. L qx and x dx equal to qx to the power of dx multiplied by dx to the power of nx, which can be simplified to L, Qx to the power of Dx, 1 minus Qx and X minus Dx. The second step of MLE equation is ln L equal to Dx ln Qx plus Nx minus Dx ln 1 minus Qx. Then the third step of MLE equation is Dl over Dqx equal to Dx over Qx plus Nx dx over 1 minus qx equal to 0. When we solve the equation, we will get q hat x equal to dx over nx. Okay, the second thing that we need to know is single decrement environment, special case A and full data. We recall that full data is when precise age and z is used. Okay, for individual i, we use Li equal to SIPX multiplied by mu X plus SI. And for all that, we use LD product of DX, SIPX multiplied by mu X plus SI. Under single decrement environment, special case A and full data, we have two distribution, which are UDD assumption and exponential assumption. Under UDD assumption, the equation is L equal to 1 minus qx to the power of nx minus dx, qx to the power of dx. Then the second step of MLE is ln the equation, ln L equal to nx minus dx, ln 1 minus qx plus dx ln qx. Then the third step of MLE equation is differentiate the equation, dl over dq equal to nx minus dx over 1 minus qx plus dx over qx equal to 0. 
When we solve the equation, we will get Q hat x equal to dx over nx. For exponential assumption, we just need to know the equation that is mu hat equal to dx over nx minus dx plus summation of dx si. Okay, now let's continue with partial data special cases. From this timeline, we can get dx equal to c minus d prime and d equal to d prime plus d double prime. And d prime is the number of people die in the CX sample. Meanwhile, d double prime is the number of people die in the NX minus CX sample. So the total death is just plus d prime plus d double prime. Likelihood equation for the CX sample is LC equal to SQX to the power of D prime times Y minus S times QX to the power of C minus D prime. Maximum likelihood equation for the NX minus CX sample is LN minus C equal to 1 minus QX to the power of D double prime times 1 minus QX to the power of N minus C minus D double prime. So, the total likelihood equation is LC times LN minus C. Under UDD assumption, we must know SQX equal to S times QX. So, under UDD, the likelihood equation is S to the power D prime times QX to, to the power D prime plus D double prime times 1 minus SQX to the power of C minus D prime times 1 minus QX to the power of N minus C minus D double prime. Second step under UDD is ln L equal to D, double, D prime ln S plus D prime plus D double prime times ln QX plus C minus D prime times ln 1 minus S times QX plus N minus C minus D double prime times ln 1 minus QX. Third step is we differentiate DL over DQ equal to D prime plus D double prime over QX minus S S times C minus D double prime over 1 minus S times QX minus N minus D minus EX over 1 minus QX equal to 0. Next, we will solve to find QX. So, QX equal to B minus square root B square minus 4S times NX times DX over 2 times S times NX where B equal to NX minus 1 minus S times EX plus S DX. Second step is ln L equal to D times ln 1 minus PX plus N minus E minus D times ln PX plus S times E times ln PX. Third step is dl over dp equal to negative d over 1 minus px plus n minus e minus d over px plus s times e over px equal to 0. So, when we solve, we want to find the qx which is qx is equal to dx over nx minus 1 minus s times ex where it is actuarial estimator for special case. Okay guys, the last case for this topic is special case C with random sensory. From the timeline, we all know that case C is consists of Ri equal to 0 and 0 is less than and equal Si less than and equal 1. Special case C with random sensory is used to find QX bar, which is the marginal probability of death before scheduled ending age. Therefore, QX bar is equal to 1 minus PX bar. It's also equal to 1 minus integrate 0 until 1 GS times SPX DS. Integration 0 until 1 GS is equal to 1. Thank you.
The solution for the example is L equal to ST to the power of 500 minus 5 product I1 until DX5 FTI DT. As we know, FT equal to negative S prime T where given ST is equal to E to the power of negative AT over 2. Negative S prime T equal to negative E to the power of negative A T over 2 times negative A over 2 where equal to A over 2 times E to the power of negative A T over 2. So, F T is equal to A over 2 times E to the power of negative A T over 2. So, it will be e to the power of negative a times 4 over 2 times 495 times product of a over 2 times e to the power of negative a uh, in the bracket 1.1 plus 3.24 plus 3.5 plus 3.3 plus 3.9 close bracket over 2. So, the L will be equal to e to the power of negative 990a times a over 2 to the power of 5 times e to the power of negative 7.5a. For the second step will be ln L equal to negative 990a plus 5 ln a over 2 minus 7.5a. For the third step is dl over da equal to negative 997.5 plus 5 in bracket 2 over a in bracket 1 over 2. Okay, so we will solve for a and the answer we will get a equal to 0 0.005013. So girls, are you ready for the quiz next week? Yes! yes. So we call my seniors to come to see us. So now we just see her. Ready? Okay. Yes, sure. We will see her this right. Ah, why is this so... <laughs> we need to recall that what is special place is. Special place A is Ri equal to 0 and Si equal to 1. And partial data, what, what was that? Uh... Okay, the solution for the example is L equal to ST to the power of 500 minus 5. Sorry. For the third step, where DL over DA. Yay, that's yeah, finally, we already finished our sumo video. So hope you guys like it and enjoy. We will upload it in